Hey, what's going on dudes? Dudes and girls and whoever is watching. Today I'm making the road for Hog Mountain. That's it. I have to get in there. This is where I'm at. I am currently at 2767 trophies. I calculated, I did a little bit of calculations and I need 233. So that's about eight wins. I think I can do it. Okay, there is no reason I can't do uh, eight wins. I don't know if I can do eight wins straight in a row. But we're gonna do it right now. So what we're gonna do is we got a few chests. We're gonna free up some slots. So we got a wizard and we got a minion horde. We got a rocket. We got elite barbarians. A few weeks ago, I won a raffle. I won a uh, raffle for ten dollars. And what I want to do is I want to make a purchase and upgrade my cards. So we do currently have this offer. We have a super magical chest. And I've been posting uh, yesterday on Facebook and some of my other social medias on what's the best way to go here because I usually don't jump so if I got these 10 bucks I want to use them and I think they're currently like synced into my account here there we go so it's ten dollars so we'll have like a random penny so but I'm gonna hold off I think what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna try to go for a legendary uh, arena which is hog mountain and then in there I technically should get an offer for a legendary chest, 1200 gems, and 100,000 gold. I think everything is set. We have uh, two counter troops. We have a musketeer for air, and then we have a uh, furnace for defense. We've got arrows and fire spirits for anything air related, so baby dragon, minions. Uh, we got our prince, of course. This is gonna be our uh, clutch card today. Uh, we got Skarmy for something tanky. I really should use an Inferno Tower, uh, but that's gonna be a little bit expensive. How much is that gonna be actually? 3.6? Hmm, I don't know. No, 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 L let's stick to Furnace. I don't wanna make any last minute changes. All right, so here goes. All right, so we got our first match here. Let's see who we have. We have Carlos Rando for Yukanuba. Uh, let's see what he's pushing. Uh, do we wanna wait? No, we do not. Okay, so here, let's stop this push. And we're gonna put a musketeer over here. Boom, boom, boom. All right, good. So we're gonna play the opposite way. Let's see what he has. Is he gonna stop that? He did. And you know what we'll do? We'll just push a Valk here, and then we'll do a Skarmy on this side. So he has a he has a fairly looks like our Valk is not doing so good against his barbs. This should be perfect right here. He's very aggressive. Okay, now we're naked. Oh man, I kind of screwed it up already a little bit here. Okay, we're gonna throw him a well played. That was well played. We're not gonna let him build up for whatever he's trying to do. We're gonna go Prince over here. And then we got these arrows. Is he gonna stop that? He did. Okay, so that was good actually. That was good. I didn't want to let him do too much damage. We were a little bit early with the Prince, uh, with our uh, Musketeer. And that's okay. And I really should have put a Valk in there. We're gonna... We're gonna do this. Uh-oh, my phone is freezing. Dang it! Dang it! My phone froze, guys! Dude! Oh, man. Okay, well, this, this match is... Uh... Something's wrong with my servers. So this sucks. I'm trying to uh, find something to play. Uh, they got some weird stuff on here. Angry Birds? Who's going to Angry Birds or show? Finding Dory. Ooh, we're going to play this one. I like this one. <laughs> Alright guys, we're going to play uh, Finding Dory. I tried to play some Spongebob. I couldn't find anything. Like on, I couldn't find anything on Netflix. Uh, then on Netflix, like kids. Um, but here, I was, uh, I was upgrading these cards. Are we rolling? I think we're rolling. Yeah. I was upgrading these cards and my storage filled up. So here, we're gonna upgrade this knight. Okay, so now we got a level 9 knight. That's perfect. And then we're gonna upgrade this zap. So whenever they're gonna have a minions or something, it's gonna deal enough damage for my tower to take out. Now, I wanna have enough gold for a le just like a legendary card, hypothetically, let's say. So what we're gonna do is we're actually gonna just upgrade this too. We're gonna upgrade the zap. To level nine i keep donating my cards and i never focus on myself you know what i mean 
So I really want to focus on my own cards for once. It's really hard. It's like it's hard running a clan because you kind of have to try and meet everybody's demands. And here we're going to be pushing for Hog Arena here in a second, but. Um, I think there's another guy besides me. Yes, Francisco. He donated a lot more than I did. Uh, Trainer, Hall, he's coming up up there. Lepi. Um, there's a few guys in here that donate. Uh, one, I think, that donated more than I did. That was Francisco M. So nice job, Francisco. And so he's, he's, he's play, he plays a lot. But I always, when I always donate my cards, I'm like, man, but I need to upgrade my stuff too, you know? So, we'll be going in with a new deck right now. The first one just wasn't cutting it out. I lost a lot. And then I won just to get back up there, but we're still down. So, we're going to do is we're going to push a hog. We're going to push a hog. We got Zap for whatever he has. Uh, we got Skarmy. Skarmy is going to be helpful. We're going to use this for in case we get something tanky. And I think this should be a lot better. I think this deck is going to definitely... Uh, we should see a little bit better gameplay here uh, so the class we have a best hand right now where you're gonna just do this and then we're gonna have zap on hand uh, here let's we're gonna get a few hits over here we're gonna just zap this right now there we go already a whole lot better a whole lot better we're not uh, we're not like grinding our teeth over here you know uh, we're gonna wait to see what he does we have a perfect hand to defend against e barbs uh, something tanky if he wants to push uh, Looks like we're both waiting on our elixir to charge up over here So what I will do is I'm gonna drop my troops because I saw how he dropped on the river over there and We're gonna we're gonna push our hog. Oh, actually I should have put him in the back actually And then we're gonna send this lightning off Because that's gonna take out his card and we're gonna get one more hit So we're really low on elixir right now. We'll see what he wants to do I may have to actually let that Mega Minion do its thing. Okay, we're gonna do this. And then we're gonna put these guys in the back. Oh man, he just got some value. Here, we're gonna just have to just zap. <laughs> well played, wow. Oh, he's pissed. Wow, you're pissed. Haha. <laughs> let's throw some, let's throw some bad manners. Let's throw some BM. Let's throw some BM, screw this guy. Who is this guy? We don't know who this guy is. Oh, he has a Lava Hound. No wonder he's ticked. Yo, I should have used... No, well, my lightning would have been a little bit too early. Here. Oh my gosh. Here, he got his... Uh, what's it called? He got his... Uh, Electo Wizard. Electo Wizard. There, that's perfect. Perfect. Let's uh, let's put our hog in. I don't know what he has. Let's see what does he have. He doesn't have anything. We're just gonna lighten this guy. Ah <laughs> oh, man! Oh my goodness! What does he have? Where is your log, buddy? Where is your log? Oh, uh, he doesn't have one. Of course, he has not one. Alright, we're gonna play a little... We're gonna play the other side now. Let's see... Let's see if we can split him up. Alright, he's playing just to be nice now. Boom, son! Boom, Aloysius! Here, we're gonna hold off on our Skarmy. Uh, we're gonna zap this situation right here. We're gonna do this. And there comes his uh, Skarmy. Alright, that's a good game. That is a good game. What do you guys think? A whole lot better, no? Look at this deck, it's a lot stronger. Oh, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Thanks. Oh! Burn! 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 We threw a thanks. He got a... I really shouldn't do that because I've been in spots where I lost a lot. Uh, today I'm not gonna let that happen. So, uh... I moved on to a, uh... A, a little food break. It's like 5.30 right now. And there's a fairly like nice sunset out today. Let me show you. I guess you guys are getting like a vlog today. Yep, there we go. 
So this is what we got going on. I'm down, I'm down 150. Uh, I'm getting all these like random decks. You see, that's what's going on. I cannot get a consistent deck from these guys. They're all like, look at them, they're all random. So let's go in with a live one. Here, let's go. All right, so anyway, I got a, uh, I got a cheese tomato sandwich. Mm. Really good. All right, we don't have a really good starting hand here. Let's go with the Naked Hog. And then the Lightning. So we're gonna get some damage, actually. A little expensive start, but um, at least we know what he has. And then we have just enough to cycle to a Knight. Okay, the knight should shut that down. Man, these e-barbs are really, really overpowered. All right, guys, so this is day two of the uh, legendary uh, arena push, and it was going great. It was going great. I was at uh, 2,800 trophies, and then look at this. Lost all of them. So now I got a, a new hog deck, uh, which was uh, has lightning, Inferno Tower, and I spent all of my, uh, a lot of the gold yesterday on it. And thankfully, uh, today is uh, Epic Sunday. So, uh oh. Somebody's kicking somebody out in here. Firas. I don't know why Firas is doing that. Okay, I'm gonna have to take care of that later. Well, anyway, so here, we're, uh, we're pushing, so we're pushing this deck right now. And uh, really good cards, really strong cards, level 9s. Uh, we got it we, today. I think I got a. Uh, oh no no! I need to do a level six hog soon. So that's what I'm requesting now. And I put a princess in here, which I got from a free chest. So here, let's go into one battle. I'll show you guys how this deck works. And you're like, gee, Alec, you're you're one to show, losing 250 trophies in a matter of minutes. So basically, um, there's two variations here. There's two win conditions. Uh, chipper deck. Here, we're just gonna do this right now because I think those are stronger. Okay, so we got a lot out of him already. We're actually doubled in. The, we're the same in elixir, and uh, we're gonna do this. That is a uh, that's a strong guy right there. That in uh, that inferno dragon. He has a level two inferno dragon. That's nothing to joke with. My tower alone will not do that. So he's getting a little desperate here. He's pushing. A naked hog and he was very late with a zap so um, look at you see looking good right now okay but these previous games I was like man I'm, I'm totally winning them and then in the last 10 15 seconds uh, you know you just lose you just lose so um, I was playing this uh, Pekka deck earlier and I had I was playing an inferno tower and I was like, man, I had him. I had him in the bag. And then the last like 25 seconds, he comes at me with a P.E.K.K.A. and a minion horde and he completely shuts me down. Here, we're gonna have to do this number. Actually, my princess is gonna help here. So that was perfect. So he spent he spent nine elixir there. Uh, is our princess gonna stay alive? No. Uh, right now is a good time to push a hog, a naked hog even. And then we're gonna just do this. If he comes with it. So this is how you play it, basically, like this. All right, what's up, guys? <clears throat> I opened up uh, the clan chest and I got Fairly good cards. Um, I don't use a bowler, but some of my clanmates do, and Elite Barbs, of course, a lot of my clanmates use that, so we can donate that. I'm actually gonna buy a uh, Epic Chest right now, so you guys will get to see that. Basically, I got, uh, the, the, I got another phone, and so what I'm doing with that is I'm using it as a camera. Uh, this is my room. <clears throat> I took my backdrop off because I was like, okay, it's a little bit impersonal, you know, like I do this every day. I might as well show you the rest. And I got some TV playing. Uh, while I'm recording sometimes, I like to have something that to bounce off of. 
So here, these are the two gameplays. We're just gonna watch one. The first one is against the Joner. Good player, good deck. He has a uh, he has a fairly good level uh, hog, and he's pushing a fire wizard right behind it. So I start off with uh, just something to get a little bit going out of him. I start off with a, a goblin gang. See, he has a level eight fire wizard, a level eight fire wizard, and he's pushing a level seven mega minion, a level eight hog. I mean, I, at first I was like, okay, I think this guy might be a gemmer. I think he might be a gemmer. And nothing against gemmers. If I could gem, I would. But what I notice is sometimes people think if you gem, you can win easier uh, because your cards are stronger. But there's, a, there's still strategy to learn and what each card does. So uh, he also has an Inferno Dragon, uh, level 2, mind you. So at this point, I was like, okay, I think this guy is definitely a gemmer. Um, he just bought like a few chests, put in like a couple hundred bucks in the game. Uh, so that's good for him, you know? Hey, to health and happiness, as they say. He has a level 9 goblin gang. Really strong cards. So I counter that with a Skarmy. Um, and the, you see what that does is it slows the Inferno Dragon down enough for me to uh, just distract him. Uh, at this point, I, I'm like speeding the game up just for you guys to get the point. So then at, that's it. At this point, he gave up. At this point, he stops playing. Um, and at this point, I'm just trying to make really good screenshots uh, so I could share with you guys. So I put like two princesses down on the left side and I'm trying to cycle to my third one. So I put three princesses on him. <laughs> so, so pretty fun gameplay. Very easy. We're really high up there. Um, I think I was like 2750 or 2780 at this point. Here, we're going to watch another one. Same scenario. Same scenario. The guy just... its It felt to me like the first push. But he kind of quit after the, the second or third push, I think. And he's like... If I was a level 10 and I had gems, you know, I would... I would probably play a really strong deck. And I would practice with it a lot first. Okay, and then I would try to go into games. If you're jamming and you think like the cards will help you win, more than likely it will not. Okay, you still have to know. You see, you can't throw a hog down into a Skarmy knowing that I have a Skarmy when there's a defense. You cannot do that. You got to throw something else down or at least, you know, watch your elixir so everything can, uh, you know, so, the, so my furnace goes out. So he pushes a... Uh, a, a bandit and I learned the best counter for that is probably a Valk or a knight so I since I keep a knight in my deck um, he was perfect for that he still had like half a health he stopped the uh, prince so at this point I think he's trying to cycle to his hog because that's like his best card to play so right now there was really no need for a, uh, a log I really don't think that I think a log would have been perfect for his uh, hog so, uh, you see, it's, it's really kind of telling you like he doesn't know what he's doing. So at this point, I th if I remember correctly, I think he stopped playing. And um, so I, I put my princess down. I'm not really sure what's going on. I'm still trying to get stuff out of him. So here, at this point, yeah, he definitely game up. I, I'm trying to speed the game up a little bit just to show you guys what's going on. So we take his uh, tower down. Uh, I go on his right side. So I'm trying to do the princess thing again, uh, but I couldn't cycle in time to a third princess. So, you know, so that's what happened. Anyway, guys, I'm on the road to Legendary Arena. I hope you guys can join me and support me in this feat. Please, please, please recommend a strong trophy pushing deck. Uh, give me some commentary on it and what I can do with it. Anyway, guys, I hope you enjoyed it and I'll catch you in the next video.